Our next scenes are shunting operations in Donegal Town, showing the signal and point changing necessary to permit these, with a view from inside the signal box, which was at the north end of the main platform. The signalman in these scenes was Willie Hegarty, and he had a choice of around 28 levers to pull to control all the signals and points in Donegal Town Station, which was a junction on the railway. Here is the edge of the turntable with one of the articulated rail cars, appearing to be number 18, being turned while number 14 arrives with a train, either from Stranola or Ballyshannon. We will see the train staff for the section the railcar is travelling in being exchanged by Joe Thompson, the railcar driver, before he pulls the railcar into Donegal Town Station itself. We now have some rarely seen angles looking at the signal box from the northeast. To the left of it is the original whitewashed goods shed building, which has since been replaced. And in between that and the signal box is the bus garage in dark grey or black, which is still there to this day. In a moment we shall see Willie Hegarty making the roads, as they say, in the signal box, and we shall get a glimpse of his view of the track work and turntable. Inside the signal box are the lever mechanisms, but as well as that, mail and milk as loads for the rail car, the train being the main mover of mails in those days. And milk was still carried in small quantities in churns, as we can see on the left here. <laughs> 